Each year, Open Doors assembles the World Watch List to focus the world's attention on places where religious freedom is limited, where persecution occurs. The list includes the 50 most oppressive places in the world for Christians to live. The purpose is to enable followers of Jesus around the world to unite in prayer, advocacy, assistance, and encouragement for suffering believers. Let me tell you about the top 10 countries on the World Watch List for 2010. Number 10, Uzbekistan. Here it is illegal to tell people about Jesus or import religious material. Media campaigns against Christians are widespread and many are forced to leave their homes due to threats by their communities. Number 9, Laos. Christians here are under strict government surveillance. Communities apply severe pressure to anyone who abandons the worship of evil spirits. Number 8, Mauritania. Converting to Christianity is a forbidden here. The government is increasing the pressure on Christians through threats of imprisonment or death. They're seeking to eliminate the gospel's presence and impact. Number 7, Yemen. Islam is the state religion. No one is allowed to convert from this religion. Disobeying this law brings severe opposition and possible death from authorities and extremists. Number six, Afghanistan. Christians must remain hidden here. If they are discovered, they face the loss of their family, home, and job. They are beaten, imprisoned, and often killed. Number five, Maldives. All citizens must embrace Islam. If anyone converts to another religion, they face the loss of citizenship. The government believes this severe law promotes national unity and retains their control on these islands. This is the least evangelized country in the world. Number four, Somalia. Islam is the state religion here as well. There is no religious freedom. Christians have been kidnapped, raped, and killed in 2009. Converts who are allowed to live become family outcasts and practice their faith in secret under extremely dangerous conditions. Number three, Saudi Arabia. Non-Muslim public worship is forbidden. Disobedience brings arrest, flogging, and deportation. Christians risk death threats and honor killings. Number two, Iran. According to a new law, converts to Christianity face a mandatory death sentence. House churches are monitored by secret police, and members are often arrested, questioned, and beaten. Number one, North Korea. Everyone is required to worship the leaders, Kim Jong-il and his father. The regime believes their power will collapse if they fail to stop the spread of Christianity. When Christians are discovered, they are sent to deadly labor camps or secretly executed. You can learn more about helping Christians who are persecuted in these and other countries by visiting Open Doors website.